Hello everyone, this is Fantastic Worlds, welcome you back to Lovecraft Country and Darkest Dungeon Tips and Tricks, and here we are, not having a live episode again. I do apologize, of course, or I would apologize if it was my fault, but my internet service provider is unfortunately not providing service. But we shall soldier on, and at least I'll be able to load this up to YouTube. In any case, we left off having a very successful... Gash run with 22,362. Not only that, we managed to upgrade the guild to a level two, not only level three skills, but we also have now 30% off all costs. So I'm going to use this enormous amount of cash to just start pumping it into the uh, people I put out there skills to rack them up. Of course, making sure that I, they have enough armor. That's kind of the kicker. Now, as you can see, we've got a few people out doing for maintenance and such, and I think. I will actually toss Bozette in. Oh, apparently all you do is gamble. Oh, great. You do that. All right, to do some stress relief. Now, the other thing is that we need to decide which mission we're going to be doing. Now, what the next minor goal, as it were, for upgrading, I want to increase to experience recruits so I can get more than level zero people to start with as we're kind of exceeding the point. I mean, it's getting to the point where I'm not sure I'm going to be able to pull this gesture out. I may have to um, recuse him for a more advanced one later on, but in the meantime, since we know our target and we know what it will cost to do so, we need to pick what we're going to be doing for the run. Now, we need three busts and we, have, and we need all of our crests. Now, crests are going to be a dime a dozen from the random RNG gods pulling from uh, pulling from uh, random treasures when we kill people. You know, the stuff that they have, the crests seem to pop up like all the time. So that's not the issue. The issue will be the busts. Now, get a quick look, by the way, and we are kind of bustless. The biggest the easiest ones to do is probably going to be purifying the altars, which is a medium run, and it's going to be basic level. Now, what we're going to be doing about this, however, is that we're only going to be getting a, essentially getting a treasure we already have and the antiquarians we're using right now. Now, silence in the crypts will, will mean that, of course, that when we do our next run, I believe the means that will be easier to do, which means we have to follow up going to the estate, um, sorry, the scouting mission on the estate. So, sorry, ruins. The thing is, I always think of the ruins as the estate because it's actually the building itself and all these are just kind of attached to it. But that's not going to work because essentially we have to follow up with Silence in the Crypts to um, be able to uh, do this. And the Stun Animalite is not worth it. We are we could use the Deeds, though. Okay, we could do this if we pull an additional run, a potion to bust in this run. If we don't, this is essentially just going to be good because I'm not going to turn down five Deeds. And, like I said, we can sell that at least. But we have see if we have other options. Oh, that's... Ooh, here's another one. Surgical gloves. So this is a short veterans run. Now, that gives us an old, another idea. Now, we haven't done a veterans run yet because we haven't a lot of veterans. But as you can see, now half the map is currently green or blue. Which means I could easily pull out an, a, a worthy group. This, however... It's questionable whether I want to leave behind Renera doing so. Basically, I'd be down to... Oh, yeah. We only have one meat shield at the moment. And he's currently having brain surgery. So we're going to leave off the veteran mission until later. So in the meantime, uh, let's see. Do... Oh, God. The Antiquarian gets a lot of stuff. This one. Ooh, the old road score is obscured by corrupted poisoned overgrowth. Explore and return with the full description of every side path. So 90% of rooms, we've going to have one set of firewood to be able to do missions and such. Now, I'm actually thinking of the grave robber. Oh my god, that's awesome for the grave robber. Does she already have a full gear set? All right, plus two speed, minus two. Yeah, I could probably, I'd probably replace out the blighting satchel because... That on this 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 is ooh, it does increase our stress a bit, but as you notice, uh, stress is one of the easiest things I've been handling so far. So I think we should consider this for our veterans run, and sh I definitely want to take her when we do. So I always think it's appropriate that if we're going to get a treasure for someone, we should probably bring that person. So in the mean, we, we'll keep that off for the three busts of the next run, which basically keeps our hand a bit clean. No, no. So, yeah, let's get the five deeds at least. This should be one should be pretty easy, it's a, and we'll bring in an easy crew. So, first of all, oh, problem is you guys are bleeders. They don't do a lot. Skeletons don't bleed a lot. So, you guys aren't going to be as useful. But we could bring the Abomination. Now, he is 
of course, good for a front line, and he's got that odd uh, ability to turn into a, a Hulk-like monster and destroy people. So we bring him. We're going to have to bring, because he's at such a low level, we're going to have to bring some more experienced people to go with him. Now, I'm thinking, actually, we're going to take in the Plague Doctor and the Occultist. Those two work well together, so both healers, and if his super heal causes a bleed, we can always counter that with his ability to remove bleeding and blight. And that means, however, we're going to need a decent amount of firepower. Now, we can't have Watu because she's a rear guard one. Rousseau doesn't... She, if I take her off dancing, you know, she's... Uh, problem is her minor ability is bleed as well. It's not a huge thing if we lose that. Oh, gods. You. Dirk Stab. The problem is it's a bleed ability. Two bleeds abilities. We could take this off, put in the buff, because the buff's always good to have. And inspire... Ooh, inspiring tune to reduce stress. Take out... Mark target because he's not moving with a mark squad. So that could be standard attack, a finale, which means that which is of course when he gathers up um, all of the increases from his other damage. So we should probably forward three. Ooh, solo shoot forward solo three. We can do a single dance party here. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I think we can do this. Solo and finale was the standard attack, and inspiring tune should be sufficient. So I guess we will take him, even though it will be a little less firepower than I like. But, of course, what we're going to do is start giving people their uh, stuff. Now, I remember this time, which is great. Moose Moon, I don't have a man of arms. Additional damage, we'll pick that for somebody else. Book of Intuition. Minus 20% surprise, minus 1 speed, your speed is 6. But since you're a healer, you actually want to go slightly less than other people. I'm going to take your book intuition. We do not want to be surprised. Okay, you. Plus four speed, minus one. Yeah, that's not bad. It's plus seven crit, though. We'll probably do better. Ooh, why don't we increase your speed a bit? Yeah, this is going to switch out into a standard speed. That counters that. He's just a straight up plus four dodge, which is good. All right, what do you got? Ooh, plus 40% disease resistance. Okay, but. Mm hmm. Should we give you the standard combo? Less stress? I think we should. Less stress. Um, healer combo. And as for you... Oh, boy. Okay. Plus five dodge. Let's give you a warrior's cap. Ooh. That's something good for dark. If I really needed the cash, I'd go a little higher. But slippery boots, plus four dodge again. But minus 20% resi uh, remove resist. Which is problematic because we've got a bit of a thing. But we can give you this. Yeah, you're going to be doing a lot of stress relief. And also, I think... Oh, whoops. This is going to be interesting. And can I put Hembu in the level 2? Uh, in this in, in, uh, second place. Because this guy has to... Actually, no. What we will do is we'll bring him back and forth. Which means this is gonna this guy's going to shift between... Come on, drop the equipment... Four, so you can do that from the th position three, position or is it position two? Battlefield medicine he can't do, and disorienting plastic he can do. So he's pretty good, except for the battlefield medicine, and that's only going to be used for small purposes. So yeah, I think he's going to be okay. This is going to be an interesting combination. It's kind of a little league squad, but we're going a little league kind of adventure. So twenty-four. Yeah, we're going to have to keep his health high. It's going to be a bit low for tanking purposes. Yeah, we're going to be a bit critically slow, but, I mean, a bit critically low on power, but I think we can pull this off, and we'll get those deeds bring us up to nine, and some of my other ambitions for building can be done. But in the meantime, make sure we got everybody where we want them. Now I already started out your abilities. You've got the healer combo, you've got the eldritch bomb. And the only thing, is there anything else that he can possibly use? Trap disarming? You're not really good at that, are you? Uh, who is good at trap disarming? Let's see, your trap is 40, 30, 40. Oh, yeah, you might as well take it. All right, that's it. We're switching you out to trap duty, even though it's kind of really sad. There we go. Okay, so you're in for adventure. Let's give it to you. But before we go out anywhere, snap back, and we are going to head to the training guild. See if we can get anybody's skills up. I think we can. Yeah, let's do the best price. Let's just get everything up. Yep. That is a lot of boost. I don't think... Yeah, I can't... Whoops, no, Neville. Get in there. Do you have anything we can use? Yep, all of it. All of it. Look at how low it is because we made all that investment into the training facilities. That is how you play the long game. I think you're zero, so I don't think we can do anything with you. You are hopeless. Yep. Don't know the left side from the right side. 
Last one. Watu. Okay, so this time we're going to be a little closer since it's a lot more expensive. Um, since we'll be probably using his base attack. Okay, the heal obviously goes up. Uh, the vulnerability hex we're not using as a mark. Yeah, we should actually double check to see what you've got. Yeah, we don't want your vulnerability hex. We want... Let's see, BUF target. Ooh, kind of like this one for, you know, the range attack with the stun. So, yeah, we'll take this, which means that we're going to be using stab, heal, uh, pull. Um, pull's not actually as effective as it is in this combination. So let's just use him as a rear artillery squad and with the potential to stab people if they get too close in front, which means these are the abilities we're going to use. Abyssal activity, Cestrals will stab, weird reconstruction, and hands from the abyss. So let's get handsy. That was terrible. Okay, handsy, stabby. Let's see. Ropey and healy. Yeah, we got that. All right, so yeah, I think we're doing cool here. Okay, so... Let's go embark. We've got plenty of cash left over for doing other people's skills, so let's... Oh, one thing, one thing. One thing I do not want to forget on the way out, because I want to get too much of a hurry. So make sure everybody's got the best gear possible. Yeah, I'm actually going to start increasing the weapons since I got that capacity now. Ooh, yeah, you definitely need some upgrading. All right, Neville, what do you got? Yep, yeah, there we go. A little bit more. There you go. And you're hopeless. Okay. Oops, sorry. Okay, so now, finally, after an entire day going back and forth in the dungeons, let's actually take our little trip. Okay, so... Nope, nope, this one. Right, the five deeds, which is a decent haul. Okay, so all we have to do is scouts. I don't even literally, literally have to do all the broom battles if I don't want to. So... To the abyss. Okay, firewood, medicinal herbs, and anti-venom. Not exactly the combo I'm hoping for. And I believe... Yeah. Medium, so we're going to have to do a decent amount of torches. And at least 12 of this. And I'm going to take a shovel, just because I'm kind of paranoid about these sort of things in the key. Yeah, this doesn't need much space, but we're going to be chewing up this stuff like crazy. Plus, we've got the firewood to make things better. And, of course, we're diving back to town one last time, because I'm silly and I forgot to check the Cerberus camping skills. Oh, God. I'd forget my head if it wasn't if it wasn't attached by an Eldritch Curse. All right, the cure, remove disease... Uh, heal, yeah, experimental vapors, that's definitely worth it. Courage, wound care. Heal 15%, remove bleed, blighting. Uh, you can do that normally, so I'm not worried about that. All right, you. Okay, anger management, plus 20 stress. All oh, 9 is 10 stress. Eldritch blood. Hmm, that's really good. Wound care. Get the basics up. Quickening. Oh, oh, psych up. All right, there we go. All right, so, uh, go on, what do you got? Courage, wound care. Yeah, we're chewing up time. Uh, minus 30 stress. <sighs> Ooh, that's good. Okay, so yeah. I think I think we're doing good here. And let's see. What to... Yeah, I've already got you upgraded the way I want you to go. Sell 15 stress. Combat companion 20. Ooh. Nah, no. We're already going to have to sell something, so let's get that. Yes, I'm sorry this is taking so long, unfortunately. But I just want to make sure that... We got things going right. All right, so embark. Turn that off. Okay. And let's see. It's been 13 minutes and we haven't left yet. Ah, oh, gods, I'm so bad at packing. You know, I am. I almost always miss my flights. All right, and 12. Let's get that knocked out. And let us embark. Boom. Pace out the halls of your lineage once familiar. Now. Boring. I don't know. I think maybe you could get... Ooh, so this is a pretty interesting decision. Do we want to double back here and come through here and then do all of this and come... Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, don't do that to me. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So we need one point four. We got to assume they come down. We can only miss one room. So let's double back and hit this one next. Uh, don't I? I never touch the books. Ignorance is bliss in the Lovecraftian universe. Of course, not knowing where the traps are doesn't help. Spring oh, life God. With a singular purpose. You need some stabbing to do. All right, we even got treasure. We're going to lose the key. All right, so let's see what we got. Transform, absolution. I have the wrong thing statted out. Oh, well. Move back to... So we should have him go first. That would be so cool if we could do it right. But let's transform. All right, so that means we do some killing. Rage. 
Rake. Let's see. Or slam. Oh, yeah, we need to slam this guy. If we can get him behind there, it's going to screw up their order. But unfortunately, he resists. All right, so finale. Nope. Dirk stab. That moves you into position one, where I want you to go for the finale. At the same time, we'll abyssal artillery these guys. This combination is going to take some work. You can already tell. And should we blast them? No. What can we do? What can we do? We can do an incision. On the big guy, it's not going to stop him, however. A noxious Blast will get him. Ooh, and we can shuffle to stun you. Flash buying. I oh, hate it when you do that. Uh, suck it. Oh, Abomination's getting it. Oh, right. Stress it is. Alright, and you're bleeding. Great. Two people bleeding, actually. And stress. Great! This is awesome. <laughs> this is truly, utterly... Oh, screw it. You're dead. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Ow. Oi. Alright, so, finale on you. That moves you back to the front. This means, however, that you do the Noxious Blast on him. It's not going to kill him next to the next blight, unfortunately. And you. I do need the bleeding up, too, don't I? Weird reconstruction on you. Okay. Oosh, almost. And there goes the stress. This is going to be one of our least useful, least best runs. Worst runs. There we go. All right. Surgery required. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, just... Break him. Prodigious there we go. Alone does not the and I don't have better field medicine, unfortunately. Noxious blast, stabby. Oh, dis oh, there you go. Flash bang. Excellent. And you don't get your last shot off, which is great. All right, heal this dude. Ooh. Sedated. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to solo him. Knock everybody back into position. Oh, wait, I marked myself? I should have read that better. Really? One would think I should know how to play this game by now. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. All right, and we have another shovel. All right, that's weird. Okay, so we we'll pop this in. All right, great. Waiting to be spent. Not that much, dude. All right, cool. That was like a terrible run. All right, so we're going to have to do some rearranging, if I remember this properly. But what if we put you... Yeah, let's move you back to here. So we can start him with this with the finale, and then move him back to the front. Hopefully that'll work. God, everybody's health is so low. This may not be the best combination I've done. See, the thing is, I always like to try new things. It's how I learned the original tips and tricks. Oh, there you go. Oh, ha ha! Why would I have the shovel, anyways? Even the cold stone. Well, seems we'll probably run into another one. Passage. All right, all right. Come on. Let's try to look a little better, a little livelier. Okay, more livelier than these guys. That was good timing. All right. So, first things first. You bile. These guys. That's where you should be, so you can get that Blight down. Combined with his Blight, this should be really good, except... Well, actually, yeah. That's Blight. You. Double Blight. Might finish you off. Probably won't, but it's definitely going to make it a little harder. Now, Finale or Dirk Stab. Oh, good gods. It really messes you up, but... Let's do it. That should kill him when he first comes around. Oh, thank God. It's healing. Heal him. And it's a good roll, too. Oh, and there's the stress. But at least you have the blight on him, so that takes the out their attack. Death. And he is in a bad position. Unforgiving. Not that bad of a position. I saw that coming. All right, all right, all right. Okay, okay. Considering you were here... All right, we're going to have a stress party. No party like a stress party. Break. 
Actually, let's do a standard attack. Not a rake, but a standard attack on you. Be gone. Well, Be that was effective. Noxious Blast on you. All right. Oosh. I don't know how we're poisoning skeletons, but bravo to the guy who mixed it together. All right, all right. Who do we need to heal? Him. Boom. There we go. And solo. What the heck? And. A death. <laughs> Hulk smash. Therefore, All right, we're getting the hang of this. Maintain the offensive. Okay, his cash is decent, anyways. All right, so not really much of a choice where we're supposed to be going next. All right, you up and at it. Nobody touches that. At all. Ever. Yes, we'll get to that eventually, but not with this little league team. All right, cool. Oh, thank God we actually had a scout this time. Maybe another obstacle. Hey, we're going to use that second shovel after all. Let's book it. Now, since we're doing a, a scout run, and these guys are Little League out, like I said, we're going to try to avoid that room battle, so you'll be able to move around it. We'll see if we'll actually manage to accomplish it. I have no idea why these torches are going out faster than matches, mind you. Oh, good gods. Hey, it's a slot open, anyways. Of course, it won't help us with the next one. This probably will be a third one. There's always plus one. N plus one number of obstacles. N being the number of shovels you have. As a minimum, of course. Oh, God, we don't have the key anymore, so we can't use that. And again, what's with the torches? God, dudes. Um, now I can't use the freaking uh, uh, campfire without taking stress damage. All right, that's it. Uh, I don't want to blow this so soon, though. Empty battles. Empty room, trap, and empty room. Now... Doing this, by the way, will be a quick way we can hopefully get around that trap to be have only one fight and have two more rooms. Now, remember, the number of rooms we go into is our determination. So if we can maximize the number of uh, empty places we check out. But one thing about doing the Little League team, by the way, is that nobody is really map messed up mentally. Nobody's trying to grab all the stuff around me. Abyssal artillery. OK, there we go. And bile. All right, and don't need to cure anyone. Stabby, can we stab the dude in the back? No, we can't. Can we knock blast him? Nope. Can we disorienting blast? That we can do. That's going to shuffle him to the front, making him easy prey. All right, so finale on yeah, minimize the attacks. Continue the onslaught. Destroy them all. Oof! Ow. Ah, uh, I didn't finish him off. Didn't think it was going to, but never know. Always hopeful. I hate to think of two skeletons. Two skeletons with table legs are so threatening to us. Uh, but, you know what we can do? Let's take off that stress. Bit by bit. We can just use him as a, uh... Uh, Okay, destroying glass on you. We just use him as a meat shield and have everybody else um, do the damage. I mean, because we actually do have a decent crew here. Another one there we go. Falls. All right, so, inspiring tune. Let's get some stress going. Uh, De-stress going on myself, dear gods. Dear lord, I had 80 stress on him. We're still not out of the out of the woods here. All right, cool. Yeah, we do, actually. Okay, let's stop farting around, apparently. That's what we're doing. And you take that stress off, dude. Okay, stabby. Oh, man. Don't want that guy jumping you in an alleyway. Okay, cash twice. I can do all that. Creatures can be felled. They can be oh my beaten. God. I have to use that camp wood just for the... Oh, wait. Everybody, go back to where you started. Thanks. This combo's an interesting one, but I'm not sure I'm going to use it again. I mean, we are effective against low-level threats, but... Okay, let's move to this one, because we know that one was empty. And if I recall properly, you're the ones going to have to disarm this trap. 
Dude, you failed. Mind oh, that such God, precepts are the exception and not the rule. This crew. Oh, well, at least you got one of these. Great. Minding the stuff is only the first test. I like to light up just as we go. Ah, oh, you people. Alright. I am definitely calling you this combination the Little League. Alright, so usually I won't burn a torch on the way back, but occasionally they will restock a, a uh, attack or trap, so... You never know. Always a risk. In this or anything else. I just have to manage risk. Can't avoid it. Not really. Oh, you can't avoid stress. Jester's gonna get a mind mind mech. There. Mind blacked, as I like to put it. Alright, actually, after we clear this trap, I think I mean this room, what we're gonna do is we're going. Ah, there we go. Radiance, oh hi. May we find Forgot victory. About you. Well, apparently we will. I know, I know, I'm just de-stressing him, but honestly, seriously, can you blame me? 100% stress, that's why it takes so freaking much. Oh, gods. Let's see. Actually, let's dirk stab you, sir. Oh, missed. What we can do is we can stun you. And shuffle you to the front, to this easier attack. Alright, alright. This artillery is going to be minimal effect, but we can heal ourselves. Which is good. There you go. Okay, a couple bleeds, maybe. Ooh, I forgot. You got a decent dodge, don't you? Uh, you don't. Okay. But now, A, on you. And... Noxious Blast. Nope. Sorry, any blast. Nope, we already used that. We could... Yeah, I guess we'll just Nox Blast this guy. Get some poison on him. And a dodge. And a dodge. Called it. Alright. Absolution. Yes, he's just there to be hit. Artillery, stab, heal, stab. That's, the blight should finish him off next time he goes. A little stress here. Alright, so. Neville. Yeah, he's going to come out of this less stress than he started. Ooh, you, on the other hand, have issues. Come on, get to him. Alright, no, okay, don't. Mm -hmm, Noxious Blast on you. Somebody's bleeding on our side. Oh God! A trifling victory, but a victory nonetheless. I'm going with him. It's trifling now. Ooh, we have to avoid that obstacle. And he had how many more? Well, we can avoid one. So, you know, there's no here, here, here. Yeah, let's do this and avoid that one trap. We might actually get lucky. Oh, hang on. Oh wait, we're still not even in that room. Sorry, I'm thinking too far ahead. Oh, no one touched. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We can do this, I think. All right. Yes, the medicinal herbs you've been picking up actually came in. Yeah, excellent. I'm with you, dude. Hmm. All right. Let's do this. Pray. Zero stress, mother. All right. Cool, cool. Buff or... Let's do... Let's do some stabbing. 
move the finale to that level, and we can Abyssal Artillery you two. Ooh, that's not a good feel. Ow. All right, all right, all right. So nobody's bleeding, so I don't have to worry about that. But what I can do is I can... Nox Blast the big guy, which is actually not a bad idea at the beginning. Slice and dice. Oh, wow. It, you were surprisingly effective there. Oh, no. Are we going to have a death blow possibility for you? Well, that's actually where I wanted him to go, so we're cool there. I should probably do some hulking smashing. I've been trying to avoid this, especially for your stress deal. But, let's see. Let's... All right, you dude, you need to get back to inspire. You need to get back to inspiring yourself. So we're gonna finale this dude. Yeah, heal his arse. Oh, this is gonna hurt. He's gonna die. Well, I ain't gonna miss him that much. We spent a little bit of money on him, but if we can cut our losses at the moment, I'm all for it. Nox blast on you. Oh. Champion falls. Ooh, dude, you're not looking good. Brarg. Wow, 12 Blight. And Stressed Out, and Rage on you. Yeah, the Hulk's gonna finish you guys off pretty quickly. No, it's... Okay, that wasn't terrible. Unlike last time. Alright, Decision. Or Nox Blast, or Stun him. Should get him close enough for our melee people to finish off, which... And clear the corpses. Excellent. Now... Inspiring tune yourself, dude. Oh my god, the stress. Yeah, you're going to get seriously drunk. Rage. Boom. Oh, good. We need those busts and that food. We need two more food. So two. One thing we can do, I just remembered, is we can camp and then only we'll half rations, so that means we kind of don't do so well, but we can make up for it. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Let's at least get rid of this. Half rations. A spark without kindling is a goal mm. without hope. What are we going to do? We need to de stress you. All companions, 15 stress, tiger's eye, one companion, one care. We need to reduce your stress. So, no, we're not gonna do that. Anger management plus 20. Actually, this works. Boom. Because we can get him off by using his own absolution. Courage, 15 stress reduction. Which is self medicate. Uh, plus 10. Minus 10. He's not the stressed out one. Abandon hope. Ooh, we're going to start with nothing. Nope. Courage. You. You. And see. Yeah, every rose has his thorn. Anything left on this one? Minus 15 stress. Actually, yeah. Minus 15 stress on you would be perfect for the witness. Alright, let's see if we get a random encounter, shall we? Oh, everybody's cheerful. Alright, cool, cool. Did we get ambushed? As we did not. Gains purchase, Sometimes you gotta take a risk. Lifted. And purpose is made clear. One, two, three, four. We should be able to do this. All right, so we're gonna avoid the obstacle, obviously. Ah, right, grab some cash. Glittering uh, gold. It's not really been a great run so far. Paid for oh wait, blood. everybody, back the way you're supposed to be. Thanks. You guys get so forgetful sometimes. All right, so let's try moving to here. All right. Eh, a handsome begin. reward for a task well performed. He looked in a sack. Wait, 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 wait. And you void, uh, gods. Now, remember, we want a particularly boring run here. We're going to move to this one, which is also empty, hopefully. Yeah, yeah, we don't need to take torches back with us. We're almost done. This has been a really strange one. Uh, okay, let's try this. 
All right, cool. Try that. Okay, cool. We're done. I really need to do more of the uh, um, items to go by, but I usually avoid most of them because almost all of them have a really bad side effects. Or can I go back with like empty packs? There you go. Now the thing is, we don't need to do that. We can go back anytime. We can if we really want to go to this room and look for stuff or go back to this for the fight, but no, I don't think I'm going to do that. We've already... This team combo isn't working great. I mean, I'm going to have to reset out the gesture for a dancing team. I mean, have a dancing team of three would be awesome with his abilities, but essentially I wanted to take him out for a quick run just to get him above level one, which, in fact, we have done. So, that is all. But I will be counterbalancing that with a veteran's run. To us. And we will find whatever secrets they hold. Oh, for crying out loud. You're dead. Stop obsessing about your real estate. All right. Go for it. Ooh, what do you got? Dacomia, obsessed with killing. You know what? I'm going to okay with that. Second wind. Eh. The great fast healer. Ooh, gods. We gotta we gotta start thinking about when we get the cash to be able to lock in the special the, the positive attributes we want. Town fair all treatment facility. Oh my god. Goodwill and Beverly. All treatment facilities free. Oh, it's a pity. I don't I don't have it, but cured, cured. Fear of mankind, weak grip on life, all removed. And you going up a level. Grid. First things first. Now, we're going to be doing a veterans run, so we got to pick our team first, because we usually will toss the uh, veterans in. Oh, hang on one second. In order to, to prevent this from messing up my roster, I'm going to switch to Embark and pull out the entire team. And then back up. All right. Then switch it out for a sort by level. Now, <coughs> sorry about that. It's tr very dry out. It's like 100 degrees outside right now. We're going to definitely drop in the, here, the experience recruits. That's going to take care of most of the bus we retrieved, but that's what I wanted. Now, ooh, we got to see your man at arms. I've been looking for one. Light sensitive. Uh, Belief possessed by demons. He doesn't use crits. He doesn't use melee. All right, this guy is not that good. Yeah, I'm going to hopefully wait for a more experienced one to pop up first, but at least we got that particular uh, issue out of the way. Now, the 11 portraits. What can we do with those? Yeah, we could increase the stress recovery of the bar further. Ooh. All right, but let's actually look at them our long-term goals, like the armor. I mean, sorry, the weapon tree. Okay, so... Oof. Do I take the last of our wills and increase that? Now, that would be decent for getting our armor up, and I think I actually will do that, because... Let's see. Dismas, no, two. A Dismas Renard need their equipment upgraded, so... We're going to pop that out. And the flames mold the metal. As you saw how we much it was worth it, but army. yeah, I'm going to pop this into the bar. Ooh, ripes. <laughs> well, silly me. I will pop this into the bar, but in the meantime, what to you're free. Go. Anybody? Okay. Continue. Yeah. If we do her, however, we got to pick our team. We're going to take what out because of the stress, but Dismas, Renard, we could good combination. So to Contville and Dismas. With Grishet and Rousseau. Ooh, three-point dancing team. I like it. Oh, the Mandalorian also needs to get his stuff fixed. Dude, did not you tell me he had more disease? Because gone. Treatment's free. Oh, gods. You are sinking. It's so tempting to avoid. So if you do these three, Dismas and take Bernard. Bernard, what's your major issue? Bloodthirsty. Don't really care about that. Curious. Yep. We're going to take Renard out of that one, take out Curious, and boom. Let's see who else. If we're going to take Dismas, Contive, Russell, and Grouchette as our veteran team, then we need to pick... Now, do we lock it on? Range skills is okay. Gone guard's okay. Wicked could win. Stout, that's meh. We need to find somebody to lock into place, because this is one of the few times I'm going to allow it. So, what do you want? Deadly, plus two crit, plus five jet, range skills... Fast healer. Ooh, no. No. Plus five. Evasive. Oh, that's definitely getting locked into place. We're not going to use Beset, so lock her into place and plus five dodge. We're going to lock that so she can't lose it if she gets something positive in the future. Like I said, it's one of the few times I'm going to use when it's for free, for example. I'm going to use it. Oh, gods, you, dude. I forgot you were diseased, too. 
Good lord. I think this isn't... This is the town basically taking pity on our condition. Alright, so... Let's talk about what we're going to be doing next. Okay. We need to pick... Oh my god. Champion level. Ooh, we're not doing that. Okay. Arbalist only. Norse for dodge. No way. Okay. So... Yeah. The thing is... We don't... We need to pick what we're going to be trying to upgrade next. I don't need to do that. All right, we do increase the stress relief, but let's see. We don't want the hero barracks increased yet. The available heroes isn't bad, so we might want to think about getting um. So there'll be four to pick from next time, and we've got a couple of slots open, so that's good. Okay, sanitarians. If we're going to start building towards patient cells, it's, ugh, it's a long-term goal for sure. This one. Yeah, we look like will deeds. Sorry, deeds is what we want to go for. So, do we have a veterans with deeds? It's paintings, deeds, perfect. All right, Sklor, which is a good one for a veteran. Overwhelm is obscured by a corrupted, poisoned overgrowth. Uh, six deeds plus forty percent. Ah, that with no negatives. That's actually pretty cool. So, what we're gonna do is we're gonna pick our dancing team. It is Mayas. Make sure you're statted out properly. You've got Duelist Advance and Point Blank Shot, Pistol Shot, and Open Vein, which means you probably should start in position 2. By the Hellion, because she's got her Iron Swan ability, which only works in the position 1, should stay here. But, if we're going into... where are we headed anyways? We're going into the Old Road, so Bleed is a good idea here. So let's keep both of their Bleeds up and going. Alright, so speaking of which, Gantier... That's probably not how you pronounce it, but I kind of... Oh my god, maybe I should have stuck you in the... There, but yeah, flashing daggers, throne daggers. Nope, we need a statue out for lunge. Because that and throne dagger. To make sure we have a forced attack at that rid of poison attack. Yep, that'll work. And Grisette, our healer. Extraordinaire. Usually set up just the way we want her. Ooh. You might want to consider. Alright, so first thing we do is when we have our team, is we make sure that they've got everything that we want. Dismas. Yeah, let's do this. I'm not using Wicked Slice, actually. Already upgraded him so much. All right, count eight. And maybe I pronounce her, but I kind of like it. Okay, let's use her abilities here, especially that one. Her poison abilities. Burn dagger combos well with threat with that, and pick to the face. Yeah, might as well do that for damage purposes. And the throne dagger. There we go. Let's make sure I've got that set it up for her. throne dagger. Yep, that's correct. Set. Let's just boost up your healing immediately. Okay, Divine Grace. And Divine Comfort. Let's see. Everything goes up. Everything goes up. We've got the cash. We're going to use it. Ooh. Iron Swan. If it bleeds. Self heal. And, of course, Wicked Hack. Alright, cool. Now, weapons. This my ass. Let me guess. Yep. Ooh. You are definitely going up. You are definitely going up. Yeah, we may have to do some selling here. You, I'm never bothering upgrading your on that. And, okay, oof. Yep, let's do some selling. All right, so the Bleedstone, you go. Let's see. Uh, book of Tuition, where we got Stun Amulet. Yeah, Stun Amulet definitely goes. That will get us enough cash to get through the next section. Oh, and we forgot to uh, take out all the stuff from the guys that we were using. Oh, silly me. Travel guide. Uh, waste of skin. Oh, I gotta put him in stress relief, don't I? Speedstone goes here, and you can take this back, because I don't want it. We'll take back the this combo. And yeah, you. The healer combo. Alright, so. Double back. Set. Just gonna have the standard healing combo. Snake oil to reduce stress, and where is it? Blood charm to reduce bleed, because we don't want you to stay, keep going. Now you. Oh yeah, we skipped over that one. The question is, yeah, we'll keep this as is, even with the additional. We've got the dodge. Ugh. Plus speed. Pull her out. What do we got here? Ah. Uh. This is her speed, so she always goes first, and that's going to be a good combination. I'm going to give that word a whirl, basically dealing with her speed. Now, you have nothing. I'm going to use a Mew user to plus four dodge, plus five dodge. Let's see what we've got. Scouting and disarm, it definitely goes to you. 
And since we will be using some combat abilities, do you want to use that or the strat? Nope. Plus five dodge, or... No, definitely want to keep them alive longer. Give them the hunger seal. Hunger game seal. All right, so you are what's left. You only, almost always use uh, those type of skills, and you need to increase your dodge or your stress or your weapons. Hmm. You're losing three hit points. Increasing stress, but doing a lot more... Uh, yeah, screw it. She likes to do damage. We all know Rosel loves to kill people. That's why she's in the job to begin with. All right, so now we've got our peeps. Let's head out. Let's see, where were we? Oh, yeah, you. Six deeds. So let's provision up. Good for the shovel. That's a time... Yeah, let's just keep going. 16 torches. We're going to do some decent amount of food. Yeah, we're going to get a little extra food this time. I'm still a little... Two keys, because it's more of a large one. Likely to do so. And I think we're cool. All right. <laughs> we're also broke as hell. We're going to have to do another milk run next time, guys. I knew all these paths once. Oh, let you get to your monologue. Oh, my God. Seriously? Trap right there. Got it. Where is it? Excellent. And that goes this little bit of stress we brought with us. Awesome. Let's do some killing, shall we? The veteran team's here. Okay, kill. You die now. Right. To do so, we will take poison to the face. Then... You will take an Iron Swan, because I always love doing this. Oh, we didn't even need that poison, did we? Maintain the offensive. Thanks, shot. Or do we dual advance her? There we go. Says I've been running. Excellent. Oh, stress me. Stress me. Oh, and marks, too. Oof. Ah, take it. Right then, already starting with the heals, shall we? Or, or should we get judgy? Dazzling light on the stress dealer. We need to de take out the stress. Oh, she resists. But at least get the increased on. Uh, oh my gods! Blood vision. The end approaches. Oh, stop doing that, throne dagger. We don't have a blight. So lunge on you. Press Excellent. Reduce. Give them no quarter. And do a dance on you. This is how we dance, people. Okay, definitely need to heal your ass. Attractive one, too. Okay. Yeah. Lots of blood there. Let's take that blood offline, shall we? I love that when she does that. Ow. Oh, well, of course you do that. Thank God for the dodge I added. Alright, cool. Let's... Blight you. And then we point blank shot you. Yeah, that might finish you off. It may not. Oh, great. Healer! Ooh, forgot to give her the advance, unfortunately. But we can still do some damage from back there. Okay, that's cool. Heal. Kick to the face. And duelist advance. Oh, not good enough. But you do get shivved for your for your efforts. Heal. Oh, lady, you have taken some so <sighs> Got to give her the advance one to replace the Dren Trace Drain crutch, but well, at least do the self-heal. We'll get this fixed later. Forgot to stat our skills out properly. Yeah, well, you know. I would love it body self-decompose. Okay, so... No dagger... No, poison. Always the poison. Ugh. Well, she'll be healthy as a horse. Okay, so... Mass heal. Get out of this better than we started, shall we? Point blank shot, and you're done. All right, first things first. You. Oh, I feel so stupid not doing this. For dancing team, you need breakthrough. Also, everybody go back to where you started. And we have a key, actually. 
All right, that's a lot of deeds. I think we're gonna do well with deeds. Go ahead and explore up when you ninety percent of the rooms. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're gonna have to go back and forth, but let's do the smaller one first. We get to the end, pop back. We get use the uh, use the uh, oh, what's this? Alt. You're not calling the shots here, lady. All right, cool. Wealth beyond measure. Awarded to the brave and the foolhardy alike. Uh, I'm gonna go where more of the foolhardy. Especially with situations like that. Hmm. Okay, let's go. I like the fact we have one food left because of that random pick. Gods, we're gonna be doing some serious layer lumps. Packs laden with loot are often low on supplies. Tell me about it. Hmm. Well, we're scouting, but we're not seeing much here. One attack here. Let's see. Two empty rooms. So this will be good. That can be one fight and get a lot of the scouting. Yeah, okay, the dog dies first. It's just that simple. The dog dies first. Thing is too much of a pain. Ooh. Right then, we could do this. Definitely can do this. All right, shoot the dog. Confidence Thank you. Surges as the enemy crumbles. Okay, I guess we actually get an attack off with her. And if we dazzle like the last one. All right, burn in the holy flame. Okay, I'm religious extremism. I'm all for it. Okay, okay, pick to the face. Oh, that was easy. And well rewarded, Foolish actually. Horrors. Brought, brought low and driven into the mud. Oh, I do like that DJ kick he just did there. Brought, 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 low, 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 and ripped it to the mud, mud. Yeah, that was terrible. Ah, gods. Who you once? Uh, dude, you like to rob things. I think it'll be fooling you more than often than that. Alright, let's get this one knocked out. Okay, come on. Guys. No, I think mysterious got effigies and mysterious gods we can just leave behind. Okay, everybody has some food. Feel a little better there. Alright, cool. Okay, double back. And we will grab these other two rooms, and then we'll be in the long journey home. And that is a secret room right there. And we're going to hit that on the way back. That is awesome. I am terribly sorry that I missed it on the first run. Anyways, we'll be heading back any to it. Guys, open the door. Ish. We'll be heading back anyways, and, you know, never know. Might have a uh, interesting fight, at least in that one. All right. Graves. No. God damn you. Leave it to the grave digger. You obviously don't have whatever it takes. Alright. Get in there. That's those rooms. Now we're gonna be a quick dash back, and if I'm really feeling um I'm just unless something really, really interesting happens, I'm just gonna uh skip right to the other side. Wait, the secret door, that is interesting. So alright, give me a minute, we'll be there. Okay, so everybody keep going. Keep going, yes, it's dark, and I do like the ambiance in that. But more likely to be ambushed, more likely to be surprised, more likely to do crits, and more likely to be healed, and more likely to take stress, but stress, again, isn't the biggest thing we're worrying about. And the secret door. So, since we're going to need light for whatever fight we're going to have, we might as well pump it out right now. Okay, so let's get into the right spot. And you press up. All right. Who's here? No one. All right. So, back to the lock compartment on the side. We all know what to do about that. Okay. Oh. Waiting to be spent. I'll just sell that. A lot of stuff we're gonna be selling. Okay. So, what do we give up? So, what we do is we pop these two and the put you there. Is struck. A blazing star is born. All right. I wonder if that counts towards the exploring. 
Oh, for crying out loud. Everybody is eating like crazy. We're going to have to do another half run, aren't we? I mean, a half a ration run. Okay, so if we head here, I think we probably can do is... Given the light, we can definitely have uh, another room or two before we have. Oh, hi. You're back again. Haven't you learned yet? Oh, God's poison. Thank you. Grit your arse. And right, everybody de stresses a bit. This is going to be more productive. Okay, we'll hit you. Lunge you. Okay. Not bad, not bad. Ripper stays up and going. And dazzling light you. Ah, uh, unfortunately, he's got a high stun resist. All right, so he animates some heads. Great. Cool. Deal with you later. Uh, we know what to do about this. Keep poisoning the big guy, because the rest fall when he does. All right, so... We don't need to do that, so we can do straight-up judgment. Do some damage. Oh, right. Oh. Oh, we've got some more. We've got a... He gets a man at arms before we do. Well, how'd you like that, dude? Uh, I hate ghosts. Ooh. Ooh. I guess we'll just do straight up. Because that, unfortunately, is not set it out well unless he gets back to level 2 for ranged attacks. Oh, suckage. Give me my health back. Uh, you know what? Suck it. And again. That blight is getting... Yeah, nine damage per round. With four rounds. You know what? Can we do Can we do him? Nope, we can't. We're just going to shoot him. Not sure how we're shooting the skeleton, but again, we've been poisoning him, so... Oh my god, that looks bad. Alright, Iron Swan... Hopefully, when his turn comes around, he'll die, but that, we're still going to get a couple of hits before then. Do not care. Oh, next run should hope... Oh, no, he's going to... He's going to... Ah! Grievous oh, we are getting so badly damaged here. You know what? I got a little too cocky. I hate to say this, dear, but the healer is the higher important. Keep the healer alive at all costs. You... You may have some issues in the near future. Yeah, this could be bad. No dagger. Okay, when he goes next, hopefully it'll finish him off. You just keep doing that, alright? Oh, so close. Stress. Do not flash me. Oh god, heal, heal, heal. Excellent, excellent. Oof. Do him. Thank gods. A predator is often oh. blind to its own peril. I'll take that. Yeah, that's me. I'll take it. Alright, so, you know, we are... Oh my gods. This expedition at least promises success. Okay, yeah. Odd one out. Sorry. That was painful. That definitely taught me not to get cocky in a veteran's run. Oh, wow. He's a lot tougher in a veteran's run. Like, problem is I've been doing all the basic runs for so long that I kind of forgot how tough they can be at times. All right, so... Oh, I forgot, yeah. A goal without hope. Hmm. Yep, definitely three, because we have four left. There we go. Now, wound care. Remove bleeding, remove blight. Ooh. Ooh, gets to do this. Darken Spear, Encourage my Stress. Alright, so, what we need to do with you... Bless Dodge, oh, thank God. Make sure we... Who's got the wound heal? You do. And there goes the bleeding. <laughs> Did I wash this idol? That's important stuff to know. Hmm. Yeah, we're going to use Bandit Sense, although we need some serious healing. Bless. I don't know if I have any healers. Ooh, that's going to be bad. Encourage, Sharpen Spear, Revel, Pep Talk. Clean Guns, and Encourage. So I'm all statted out for stress relief. Not that. Bandit Sense. Good, good. Bless. Can do this. You should increase your dodge for a few. That'll keep her alive a bit longer. And then we move forward. 
since we know we don't have any stress. Yeah, that could have been done a lot better, but you can say that about most of my runs. On the other hand, it is a goddamn cash run. As right. the light gains purchase, spirits are lifted. Excellent. And purpose is made clear. All right, everyone, just stay happy on me, okay? Oh wait, wait, wait! Oh no! I have a shovel, and you won't let me use it. Oh God! Yeah, you should have. Your your head's getting surgery next. Oh God! I hate this combo with the dogs. We need to get as rid of them as many as possible, people. We're gonna be bleeding like crazy. <sighs> One sh for two. But it definitely worth it. Obliterated. Just one piece of design, sweet things. It's gone. Alright, cool. Breakthrough. Definitely what we want. Because then if you have another combo, we, or I have no choice. Pump her up. Now, dualist advance. Yeah, we don't have anything that's gonna make us really kick ass, but we can at least get it that one. Ooh, of course it's gonna get her. And there's the bleed. Great. Good dodge, good dodge. Ugh. Suck it. Uh, sigh. Alright, cool. Be wary. Triumphant pride uh, precipitates no. a dizzying fall. Can, however, skip that one to avoid doubling back. Just gonna at least make this a bit faster. Oh, shh. Okay, cool, cool. If only treasure could staunch the flow of. What the is it with you? At least you dodge that. Not losing a level three character to this idiocy. Just a mere scouting mission. Ha! My arse. If it one trap, we know that who's going to be handling it. Okay, you take that. All right, cool. Extra meat is extra meat. Which means that I can afford to do this. That's right, I'm serving you rotting meat we found on the ground, but it is making you feel better, so I don't feel bad. Oh, Dismas, take that, would you? And you did. Excellently done. Excellently. That's uh, torchlight's not gonna last. Yay. Brought the shovel all this way. Even got it for free, and we're not gonna be able to use it, are we? Alright, cool, cool, cool. The hell is this? Gargoyles. Oof. Bleed resist like crazy. Slavering guard. Oh god. It's 10 hit points, 10 hit points, 41. We need to eliminate these guys first. So, first things first, as we poison dark you. Light you up. Okay, it's three hit points for a round, for four rounds. Yeah, you're definitely going to die, but let's let's up that up a bit. Bleed is out. Okay, so breakthrough. Okay, that's a high defense they got going there. Howl there. Okay, it's stress relief. Stress, got it. Horror. Which is like bleeding mind juice everywhere. Okay, you. Lash of the tail. Okay, that's a move one and a stun one. Good to know. Horror's up and running, and we are healing you. And it's a stress relief. Excellent. Right, poison you. Because hopefully in the next run we'll finish you off. Four hit points. Yep, you're dead. What the heck? Bowling? Oh, it's a lot of stress and stun to go with it. Uh, at least you're dead. Cuts on its own. Okay, so we could hack on you. Because we want to eliminate that and get you up to the point where we can, in fact, start doing some serious... Oh, decent dodge. All right, cool. But the Ripusei is up and going. You're stunned and horrid, which is great. We know what to do. Blight the heck out of her. Cut her veins open. And you. Ooh, breakthrough is not going to be as good as we can hack, unfortunately. 
You heal yourself. Uh, yeah, for at least, yeah, our anti stress measures are making this from becoming a nut. Oh, stop it. Uh, great. End stunt. Well, veteran run it is, you know? For that reason, keep slamming you with poison, you're gonna die at some point. Hmm. You can hack or. Bring... Nope, let's just continue. Standard hack and slash here. There we go. And point blank should finish them off. There we go. Perhaps the turning point. Uh, 250, 750, and 500. They only take the 750. And you know what? Let's do this. Let's be stupid. Let's guarantee we're going to have an obstacle in front of us. Should, at least we got a good cash run here. Probably right. All right. Let's go. And... Ah, why don't you do it? Do the honors. Ah! Oh, well, at least you got... At least it wasn't terribly poisonous sap. It's probably just like poison ivy. God, only four left. Come on. The hell? The hell are you? Monster with stealth and shadow appearance cannot be hit by direct attacks in front of the area. Effect attacks. Interestingly, some hero skills, like the shield versus exposed, can hit them in stealth. They have additional to de-stealthing the monsters. Okay, so... yeah. Stealth. We don't have a de-stealth one. We're gonna have to start worrying about that now. In the meantime... Let's deal with the targets we can deal with. Oh, god. So at least we're trying to. Should be de-stealth. And you're not. Interesting. Trying to get rid of you first, so you stop marking. And the Ripples get the Ripples A up. Break through. Mark Prey. God, hey. The, you put that on before you launch, dude. No, no. No good there. Okay, so we have a new dynamic in play. In that, we now have to deal worry about stealth characters. Oh, so you're like a stomp, you're a giant, oh wow, a giant controlled by fungus. That's just sucky. You die. Please, three per round, we have six left. Stress. Oh, and you're targetable now, though. Oh, lady, you should have never stepped out of the shadows, I think. Uh, but you can't follow up, unfortunately, considering the condition you're in. Uh. Oh, double dodge. Aaron Swan. Ooh, let's finish you off. Stress dealing just annoys me. Decimated. That's gonna annoy me more. Oh my god, 25 hit points? Get rid of him! Well, you're less of a problem now. Oh, this is gonna suck. Oh, God. Oof, that could be the case, actually, yeah. I've gotta heal you. Otherwise, the next Death's Door strike. Grave can wait. Yes, yes, it can. Buff you up a bit. Buffing down, wow. And a seven dodge on the other hand. Just keep spamming him. Well struck. Yeah, blood on my coat, dude. <sighs> nope. I don't want to put her out where she can take some serious damage, so we can keep the bleed. His bleed ability is going. You have no choice. You've got to heal yourself this time. Mass heal's not gonna do a damn bit of good. You're gonna have to try to heal yourself again. Meantime. Oish. I might as well not even bothered. Oh. Let's not say we didn't. Come. Um, ooh, wait a minute. How much can we do? Not enough. Heal. Oh, for God's sakes. Something kill this guy. No. Come on, pump it up, pump it up. Oh, thank God we dodged. 
already gone. Pick to the face. Finally. Oh, that hurt. Okay, so we're going to switch this out because money can always accumulate faster. Just checking to see if it worked against death door. It does no. Oh, we are limping home and we're calling this a victory. Ow. Okay, so that was the first veterans run. As you can see, they're a bit harder. Oh, God. Encouragement? Oh, achievement unlock encouragement. I guess it's my first veteran one. But anyways, yeah, at least we got, like I said, some decent cash out of this one. Three busts. Six plus. Oh my God, the deeds. 15 deeds. Whoa, we can do some serious damage with that. Okay, so everybody's gone up a bit. Everybody's level 4 now, which is good. Syphilis. What were you doing to what? How do we all get disease? The Black Plague. Resilient and Spasm of Entrails. Well, your lowest priority when it comes to that backtracker. Okay, resilient. Placed heat. Stout. I'm not sure I wanted that. Anyways. Oh, God. Everybody limp home because we are, like, messed up. Bars locked. Shortage of ale and a notable absence of good humor. Doesn't really matter because everybody's getting. I think yeah, Black Plague definitely. Yeah, we're just don't don't even bother. We're in here. Spasm entrails is not okay. That's just indigestion, disease resist, and yeah, syphilis. You're kind of a higher priority there. What? I don't even want to know how you got that. I really don't. Okay, two. What do we got? Let me set the spot. Nice to quick. We'll only drink. All right, you. The thirsty tippler will only drink. Okay. Oh God, that's too much. Mercurial, mercurial virtues. Will not pray. Plus twenty stress against humans. It's actually worth thinking about. Known cheat. Cannot gamble. Close spaces. Enlightened. Will only meditate. All right. So those ironically all cancel out. She can only meditate, so the two that reduce her uh, stress abilities don't have any any use. Okay, so two tipper. Nope. Nope. Who was I thinking about? Oh yeah, you. I was thinking actually it's worth it trying to get rid of the stress versus human. Just to make sure we haven't got anything else. Pulsive. Alright. Honestly, I'm taking out the Mandalorian the Compulsive. I have a bad idea that will cause him to do things I don't want him to do. Resistible Virtue, Chance, Skilled Gambler, Warren Scrounger. Ooh. Well, he's got half price on the gambling. That might actually be worth going. Go for it. Get me something good, okay? Alright, so got distracted with a shiny on that one. Bad gambler. <laughs> we'll never drink. Thirsty, guilty. Yeah, I think I actually may burn all of the caches, as it were, to get rid of your human, because there are a lot of humans. That's a lot of cash, but she is proving to be worth it. And the next one I'm going to get rid of is obviously not going to be anywhere near. Don't, he doesn't use range skills, so meaningless. Mm -hmm. Zoophobia. Will not pray or flagellate. Do not care that much. Will not drink. And you are messed up in a lot of ways. Obsessed the killing. Yeah, I'm not that concerned about it. Travel Stress Eater. Egomania is like so far down the list of the issues. So, hey, what do you got? Uh, never mind. Yours are all drilled into your head. Tell you what. Let's pop Neville in here and get rid of... We'll never drink. Uh, we're going to get you back off the wagon. Ooh, 13 and 15. We got to think about what we're going to do with these extra ones. But that's probably going to be next uh, day. Okay, so for our deep dive, I can't do the jester, unfortunately, why he's in stress relief or having his brains sucked out. I'm not sure which one I put him into. We're going to do the Arbalest, and the Arbalest is your sniper character. Now, this character exists in the Batku ranks, and that's all there is to it. Oh, uh, because almost all of their skills work back there, and their primary ability, as I've shown before, is to just rain death and horror among the uh, enemy. So, let's show them how to do so. Now, their primary attack is, of course, a sniper shot. Available from the back two ranks, can hit any of the anything except your enemy position one. It does a lot of damage, does a lot of crit, and, of course, I mean, you'll notice right there that it does a lot more damage to marked targets, which means that you want to put them in the hello mark. 
configuration of the party. That's what I'm going to start calling it. I am a fan of the room after all. So yeah, if this one combined with the Houndmaster, the Occultist, and or the uh, Bounty Hunter with their mark abilities is great, especially because the Arbalest tends to be slower. So the first one marks, she snipes. Now remember, she cannot attack the front rank, so you'll have to use other strategies for that. Suppressive Fire is similar, but it does tax the back two ranks and does a little bit of damage and a debuff. I don't use this one a lot. Some people uh, do, but I usually find it better to uh, take down singular targets with a lot of damage than to wound a lot of small ones. Singular exception, but we'll come to that when we get to the Houndmaster. Sniper's Mark. Of course, this is her ability to mark. Now, does no damage whatsoever, by the way, but what it does do, it removes 20 dodge that's gonna make a lot of targets good which means if you combine her you put her into a faster speed mark and have somebody else with a follow-up attack who does really nasty damage to mark targets like say the Houndmaster, then yeah that gets nasty now the only problem is if you combine this with the bounty hunter the bounty hunter's attack can only go to the first and second ranks the one that's boosted by uh marking so she works better with the hound master in this particular way or you have to be very particular about your target Okay, it's Bola. Now, Bola is a knockback ability, which is good. I suppose if you want to do some crowd control in the back. It doesn't do a lot of damage, though. And I, it does knock back the first two ranks. Again, it's not a super one. It can have its, uh, point, have its uses. Now, this is Blind Fire. You will always have Blind Fire up, no matter what. I may have violated that rule myself, but what you should be doing is having Blind Fire so that you can fire from any any rank, because it's the only one that will actually let her, if she gets scrambled to level, if she gets scrambled to position one, this is the only thing she can do, and it will buff her a plus three speed, boosting her up. Now that's going to make her a lot more effective, especially if you're doing the mark combo with another one, and she used her to do the marking, because then she boots you up. Now this is also one you're probably always going to use, is that Battlefield Bandage. Now this one's an actual decent healing. Three hit points is nothing to sneeze at, sneeze at, four, five, six, but the biggest thing about it is she'll boost other healing. So if you combine her with the, you combine her with the Vestal and the Vestal's healing just starts, especially with the Occultist. Occultist can get up to 13 healing, 25%, which is the base, mind you. It gets bigger, you know, uh, 28%. Um, that keeps going. You attach it to the 13 that she he does, and you get an additional three right off the bat. Boom. Uh, and... Of course, Rallying Flare, not the only one of the other few ones you can use in every position. This one's good to better than the previous one regarding um, the Antiquarian removing stealth, because they'll remove stealth off all characters. You notice that the uh, indicator for the targets is the entire ranks one through four. Remove stealth, increase your torches, clear stuns, clears marked targets on your side, and has a small chance at reducing a little bit of stress. So yeah, the thing is about this is that you're gonna have to figure out how you wanna stat your character. Support, which the Battlefield Bandage and Rallying Flare, or Straight Up Combat, which is gonna be Mark and um, Line and that, but you're going to have to have sniper shot as her primary attack, period. And you're going to have to probably do sniper's attack. So you're looking at a support combo of sniper, uh, sniper mark, battlefield bandage, and rallying flare. If you're going for straight up combat, you're going to be doing blind fire, um, sniper shot, uh, sniper smark, and bola. These are some of my usual configurations. You'll see them as we go along because I'm going to start switching in and out characters. And you'll also notice just how much money I'm saving by upgrading that furnace. Wow. Okay, so, and of course, as always, this is Fantastic World. Thank you for all from Lovecraft Country and Darkest Dungeon Tips and Tricks. Hope you enjoyed it. Oh, like, share, subscribe if you did. If you really like it, down below links to Gunmode Playment Platform. And you can come as a supporter. $1 initiate or $2 cultist. $1 initiate gives you additional material. $2 gives you early access and even more additional material. I'm starting a new series, by the way called Lovecraft After Dark, dealing with the surrealistic cosmic horror. I'll get more into that with the channel update. It should be coming up, or maybe just came up. Wibbly wobbly. We just came out of Mercury Retrograde, and I have not fully recovered at this point. Trust me on that one. So, in any case, we probably, I think, just passed 666 uh, subscribers, which is awesome. But once we hit 700, of course, we'll get another block of four. Plus, because remember, if you like 25, if I get 25 likes or more for a single episode, this block, I will do another one up to, of course, all of them getting it and I'll do eight. But um, given this is the last episode of the block, if we haven't gotten there already, you're going to have to hurry because otherwise I'll go back to Cultist Simulator. And with that, I shall bid you farewell.